Was Joseph believable? Well, his family seemed to think so. And sometimes it's harder to convince your own family than anybody else. He's believable to me in the way he writes, the very way he writes. And part of that comes from one of my mentors, um, from whom I, I gained a real love for Shakespeare and the literary value of the scriptures. His name was Arthur Henry King. He was a stylistician, that is to say an expert, uh, in analyzing the details of um, a book, uh, often fiction, but sometimes history, and learning something not only about the characters who were involved in the book, but also looking into the heart of the author himself. Brother King, as he was called, uh, one day uh, eventually joined Mormonism, and he said what impressed him most was what was reading the Joseph Smith story. He said, uh, that he was not inclined to be in, uh, impressed as a stylistician. In fact, he said he was disinclined to be impressed by that story. But he, as he read the Joseph Smith account, he said, this is remarkable. He's telling the story in a cool, matter-of-fact way. And he concluded by the way in which Joseph Smith told his story that he was telling the truth and became a convert to Mormonism. Joseph Smith's story strikes me in the same way.